All right, here we go. Another review. This one is the Coca-Cola Strawberry Limited Edition Seasonal Release. This one was released on January 20th, 2020 for a limited time. So I've been holding on to this for about a year and a half and uh, getting ready to taste it on camera for the first time. So let's see what's up with it. You guys heard the pop. Smells like strawberries, candied strawberries. Let's say the aroma of this one is 50% candied, 50% natural. So the aroma is sort of like a half and half between candy strawberries and, and something that's really, truly authentic. And I'm just assuming even before drinking it, taste-wise, it's going to be more or less the same as what I just described on the nosing of it. Yeah, I would say it's exactly just that. Glad to find that there's still some carbonation left inside of this one, considering how long I've been keeping it inside my refrigerator, but it's quite good. You know, there hasn't been too many of these limited edition cokes that i didn't like for the most part i like pretty much all of them not to say that it's bad but the one that i think i disliked the one that just did not taste the best out of all of them that i've had is probably the coca-cola clear and lime i mean it was passable but it really didn't do anything for me i mean just you want to pick it up just for the novelty of it and drink it. But, I mean, if it was something that was full-time on the shelf, maybe you wouldn't uh, reach for it that often, other than it just being a novelty item. This one right here, I could see myself picking it up and drinking from time to time if it was a steady, stable release. But this is something that is already come and gone off the market. Pretty good drink. Not the best out of all of them. Uh, which ones would I say that I like the best? I think I tasted the Coca-Cola Apple, which was pretty good. And the Vanilla Float was probably my absolute favorite at this point in time. And also, I think I had, I think I might have tasted the Orange Vanilla also pretty good. But this is a decent one. Passable, not, uh, not bad by any means. If you could still find it, probably through auction websites, I would go ahead and give it a shot. I mean, you want to try as many unique ones like me as possible, so go ahead and do it. Pretty good. Let's have one more sip of this. Let me open this thing up one last time. Hmm. The smell doesn't really do it for me, but <laughs> nobody's opening up Cokes to smell them. It's just something that I do being a, a whiskey reviewer, so old habits die hard wow that goes down smooth I know what I want to say strawberries and cream almost with some natural flavors inside of there and there you have it alright guys I thank you for watching this review if you've had this one before, let me know down inside the comment sections what you thought about it. And if there's any other ones out there that you're aware of that I may not be aware of, let me know and I'll go try to hunt it down and taste it for you on camera. Anyways, I thank you all for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. See you guys in the next one. And until next time, peace. Mm -hmm.